I hope you're having a wonderful day. I realized that I haven't made a video for you guys in quite some time, a couple of weeks anyways, and I thought it'd be fun to share with you kind of the cookbook process, where I'm at right now, what I'm thinking, what I'm working on. So um, last cookbook was kind of a, a mess. <laughs> I wasn't fully planned as well as I probably could have been because I didn't fully understand how much work it was to create 125 recipes in a very short period of time. So this time I've pre-planned all the recipes so I already know what's going to go in the book and what wouldn't make the cut and then from there I understand that some of the recipes I've planned just won't work out at all and they will not be in the book. Um, so I've planned for 160 recipes now probably of those 160 maybe 10 will be complete busts maybe 15 if uh if I just didn't plan right. Uh, so I'm hoping that the final book will have about 150 recipes and I'm working on sauces first because they're kind of the backbone of the whole book. A lot of the recipes are going to call for different sauces um, for recipes that are already in the book. So say if you're making a stir fry it'll say you know just add a quarter cup of this sauce that you should already have in your fridge um, and that way you can organize by okay I have these three sauces that I've made and here are the recipes that I can make with these sauces just make it easier and you can um, add variety to your meals quite easily by just changing out the sauce and make it a completely different recipe so I think I have about 24 sauce recipes uh, today I'm working on a Thai salad dressing and marinade a vegan ranch dressing that's going to be a little bit different than the first book and then we have a barbecue sauce what else blender hollandaise sauce avocado lime dressing bacon dressing made with bacon grease of course then we have chive and onion cream cheese and queso yesterday i worked on a turmeric lemon um, a creamy italian a green speckled dressing. I also did a teriyaki. What am I missing? I don't know. I know there were a couple more. <laughs> um, and Kevin is wonderful in helping me with this entire process. His name should be on the book as well. Oh my goodness. Um, he's out at the grocery store picking up um, some items for more sauces including chimichurri, basil dressing, there's a tapenade, and herby dressing and marinade which doesn't in, which uh, I'm gonna include vinegar but you actually don't have to um, so yeah I've set out all the ingredients here for all the recipes that I'm gonna be making today and I really 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 tried to um, incorporate really simple items I'm trying not to make it crazy it can be hard sometimes because when you're dairy free gluten free all the things you sometimes have to get specialty ingredients but um, throughout the book I'll recommend different things that I wouldn't generally use like soy sauce so if you don't want to buy coconut aminos I'll give you instructions on how to make um, the recipe with soy sauce instead of coconut aminos so yeah pretty stoked on this um, a lot of work in a very short period of time also in a boat I don't even know if this oven works yet I'm kind of I, I'd like to maybe experiment with it tomorrow so I can get at least 30 recipes done here in the next couple of days and then maybe by the end of tomorrow I'll turn on the oven and see if it works and if not I don't know what I'm gonna do there's only 20 recipes in the book that will be in the oven but I definitely need an oven <laughs> and I got my instant pot already out ready to go and I realized I don't have a saucepan <laughs> so um, I'm gonna have to get creative uh, until the one that I ordered comes because I ordered one for an induction cooktop which is what I'll be using once we're underway and using the boat um, I just don't like using propane and diesel and stuff I want to use energy from the Sun so that's why um, the induction cooktop but it didn't come in time so um, yeah f all fun and games over here I hope you guys again are having a great day and uh, thanks for joining me on this amazing journey to cookbook writing. I'm pretty stoked on it, and I think you're really going to love it. Okay, bye!